and welcome back to Raining Cake. So today's video is going to be a current skincare products that I'm using video. Um, I don't think I filmed a, actually no I have, I filmed an everyday skincare video for my daytime skincare and my evening skincare before so yeah this is not my first time filming skincare um, but I thought I'd show you uh, what are the current products that I'm using on my skin um, for day and night and just talk you through why I like them and you know just let you know what my current routine is like with my skincare so I have my skincare basket here uh, which is in this little gold wide basket that I got from B&Q. Do you know what B&Q actually have quite a lot of nice um, home stuff if you're looking for any home stuff I just thought I'd let you know that B&Q is very good. So yeah so this is my skincare basket and I'm just going to talk you through um, like my day skincare to start with and then on to my evening skincare and also obviously in the um, treatment stuff as well so yeah so i'll talk you through that my first skincare item 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 that i use um always is my cleanser everybody uses cleanser so i uh for day actually day and evening i use the body shop chamomile silk cleansing oil so this stuff is so so good like i never used to be an cleansing oil user um i used to never think that they um worked as such um i used to always wanting wanted like a foamy kind of cleanser because i felt like foamy and gel cleansers and all that stuff really cleaned my skin but actually do you know what this oil is so so good i use it once in the morning to cleanse and in, in the evenings i use it twice so in the evenings the first cleanse dissolves my makeup like straight away i I don't even know how, why, like it doesn't even feel like it's actually cleaning your skin but I just apply like three pumps, apply it to my skin, really massage it in, add water um, and we put a water, a layer, is that, no, just like a, another layer, it, it, when the water mixes with this it kind of emulsifies the solution and it makes it like a kind of milky colour and in that I rub that in for a few more seconds and then I wash it off um, and then I'll do another um, layer of or another three pumps of this cleansing oil and as soon as I dry my skin like I look on my towel I used to look on my towel and see like makeup still everywhere but I look on my towel and there is nothing after using this this is so good and it's not expensive either I think it might be about eight or nine pounds from the body shop and yeah it's like my favorite cleanser right now so day and night skincare cleanser I will use this oh I forgot to mention before I remove my makeup I also use an eye makeup remover so I use the Nivea daily essentials double effect eye makeup remover this is one of those by phase ones um, just mix it and it kind of combines the top layer with the bottom layer and it's just a very good eye makeup remover it's again a little bit oily um, and then it just dissolves my eye makeup really well and uh, it actually takes off all my waterproof mascara as well so that is really good and I really like the bottle because it's like a nice style and a nice size so you can just like take it away which is really good so uh, yeah so I remove my eye makeup and then I cleanse so that's the routine so after cleansing I will use a toner so my daytime toner is the Gatineau um, Gentle Silk Toner and I don't know where we can get Gatineau here. I think you can definitely get it on QVC because this is where I got this. But I don't know if any department stores sell Gatineau. Um, it is a French brand and I love this toner. Um, I'm almost like at the end of it. I've been using it for so long. It's such a huge bottle, so it lasts ages. Um, I just put it on some cotton pads and I just go over my face in the morning with this toner. And yeah, it smells really nice. It's gentle, um, It's so it's good for sensitive skin. And yeah, I, I just think it's great. It's really nice texture when it's on your skin like it's, as in it's like um it feels like it's doing something to your skin once you put it on it's quite cooling and it like closes my pores and yeah it sets like a nice base for moisturizer or serum whatever's going on after but yeah i love that toner so the next item on daytime skincare after i apply my toner is a serum so this one is the jolique herbal recovery advanced serum uh it is the bigger size it's 100 ml and I think this is quite pricey um, but it is really really good like I really love it I had a small bottle I finished using that and then I went straight onto my bigger bottle um, yeah it's really good for plumping the skin it just kind of um, it's a gel 
kind of consistency. Um, I put two pumps on my hand, on my palm, rub it together and then pat it into my skin. So it works very well with patting. I really love the technique of patting skincare on um, because I think that just like makes your skin so much more, like it kind of boosts um, circulation What by patting and I just think it, the product goes into the skin a lot better. So yeah, so this is, um, it says on the back it's anti-aging, which I do believe it is. Um, helps reduce the appearance of fine lines, helps increase elasticity, which definitely does restore the radiance, yes, definitely. Um, and increase hydration, yeah. I definitely feel that my skin is a lot more hydrated and collagen, like kind of boosted elasticity after using this every single time and I love this stuff. So after I apply my serum, I will put on some Day cream, this one is a seaweed mattifying day cream from the body shop. I really, really like it. It's um, a really nice, it's almost finished actually. Um, it's another one of those gel like textures and it's mattifying. So, for my oily skin, it's really good for ensuring that my skin is matte after applying and also it is quite hydrating so I don't um, feel like you know sometimes with matte moisturizers you feel like it's so watery that you apply it into your skin and your skin still feels dry but with this it doesn't it hydrates instantly and I've never had a problem with um, this like mattifying day cream being any anything like really dry like what am I trying to say um, that it, I don't feel like my skin is really dry after applying it so yeah so I really love that okay so on to nighttime skincare so after I cleanse my skin I do a scrub, not every day, only once a week, and I use the uh, Dermalogica Multivitamin Firma, Firmifoliant. Um, this one is um, for anti-aging, as, as it says, age smart. It is a, uh, what they call a skin polisher. So it, is, it has, doesn't have those like kind of really, it does have those granules in it. I'm not sure what type of granules, but it's not like those beaded ones. Um, it's quite a fine granule. Um, it is part of their like multivitamin range. I have the multivitamin masks as well, which is really good. Um, yeah, and this one is a really good skin scrub. I just use it, I have this routine, I do it every Friday. Um, I just put a little blob on my hand, mix it together and just like it warms in in your hand and you just apply it to your skin just kind of rub it around a bit and then wash it off and my skin is so so nice after it's so smooth and after that when i apply my um, night cream it is just amazing and i think um this really does help with definitely getting rid of the dead skin cells making my skin look brighter and a lot more radiant after the scrub so i don't use the scrub every day like I said so after cleansing generally on a day-to-day -day basis I will use the SK2 facial treatment essence I always use this at night this is almost finished like I don't have a lot left this is just like access it's like a toner um I just don't use to get a new one at night time I use this one um this one I pour into my hand I pat it together and then put it on my face again I do the patting motion put that on my face and it is just a really nice like refreshing feeling once I put this on and um it's, it's meant to help like kind of purify and restore hydration in your skin and I definitely feel it with this especially after a long day at work I definitely need um, something to make sure my skin is still hydrated and this works a treat on my skin okay so I do have a range of night products that I use like on a different day so every Wednesday I know I'm talking about routines here every Wednesday I will put on a night mask this one is the Suasu overnight vitalizing mask and this stuff is the bomb like I love it so much I think this is like my third bottle or something but um, I apply this after I apply the uh, SK2 treatment essence and I leave this on overnight um, and the next day my skin is just amazing. It's so hydrated and so plump and every time I touch my skin it's just like bouncy in the morning. So I love this. I don't know if you can get this here actually. Um, I, I think you can but it might be one of those like kind of uh, Chinese Korean websites or something. Um, but you can definitely get it definitely probably sent to the UK. Um, but yeah I love this stuff. It is Korean and yeah. Definitely, definitely recommend it if you're looking for an overnight mask. For a general mask, um, so again, after my scrub on a Friday, I will put on a mask. So Friday is kind of like my little pamper night. Um, I'm currently loving the Fresh and Brian Clay Purifying Mask. This one is a limited edition packaging. Um, but I put, mentioned this in my spring favourites uh, blog post um, previously, like maybe a week ago. Um, but this stuff is so, so good. It's a clay mask, so it purifies the skin. It lifts all the kind of dirt and horrible stuff from your skin and just 
just it comes to the surface and you just clean it off uh, my skin is so nice after using this like my it's just so much more brighter every time i look at the mirror after using this mask i'm like oh my skin oh my god my skin is so so bright and radiant and yeah it's definitely something to invest money in if you're looking for something that really uh, gets rid of your impurities and purifies your skin at the same time so lastly after um I put on the SK2 treatment essence. Now and again, I would apply um, this is the Melvita Plumping Radiance Geo Serum. Um, so yeah, so I put this on, I pump three pumps into my palms, rub it together and pat it into my skin. This one is an oily kind of serum and it works a treat. Again, it's like by face, so you do have to shake it to mix the two together and then put it on your skin. Um, yeah, I love Melvita. I don't think that it's that easy to get hold of nowadays because I'm not sure what happened to the brand but I love Melvita and I just think this product Pulped Rose it's called it is really really good for ensuring that you have a layer of moisture on your skin at night time then the night cream that I'm currently using is the Herbal Recovery Night Cream by Jolique and again it's the same kind of range is it the same range yeah yeah as the other one I believe and um, this is night cream and I'm almost again I'm almost at the end of it um, I love this stuff I just think that it's um, such a good night cream it's so deeply moisturizing and that's what you need at night time you need your skin to recover you need your skin to repair and regenerate and this does the job and yeah I would definitely repurchase over and over again this cream it's just one of those ones that works really well on my skin and lastly um, the last treatment item is a eye cream. So is a eye cream is an eye cream. Um, this one is the Clarins R Revive Beauty Flash, and I love an eye cream. I don't use it enough. I need to keep remembering to use it. Uh, but when I do, I love this stuff. It's uh, one of those ones that you. Um, I was taught that you have to apply eye cream like here not like right underneath because when you apply it and pat it here it rises and it and it does its its thing so you don't have to actually apply it like all the way around your eye you just have to apply some here pat it in and just it will just rise so yeah this stuff is definitely very good for treating um any like dark circles or any what's that word puffy eyes um so whenever i felt I feel like my eyes are a bit puffy or um they're just feeling a bit tired i just pop some on and yeah and it does work great with uh, ensuring that I my, the, puff, the puffiness like kind of diminishes and that I don't have any dark circles but yeah love that stuff so that is the end of the video that is my current skincare products and my current routine that I do day in day out um, I know sometimes people don't like routines but for skincare especially i think having a routine is good to ensure that you keep up with it um so yeah i am all for routines skincare for and i know pamper routines and stuff like that because i just love that type of stuff um but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you found it useful um i will link all the products that i use in a box bar below and yeah so please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you're new but if you're new subscribe then i will see you again soon in my next video bye guys